inside the Coliseum here in San Juan, Puerto Rico, who will be the victor? And you gotta believe this opening matchup tonight weighs heavy world heavyweight championship implications. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Air Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, the Scottish warrior, Drew McIntyre! There has been a different look in the eyes of the Scottish warrior, the man who once held the World Heavyweight Championship for 267 days. Last year at Backlash, he was defending the big gold belt against the franchise player John Cena. One year later, tells a very different story for that pissed off psychopath, Drew McIntyre. McIntyre walks down to the ring tonight with purpose. He looks at Roman Reigns as a stepping stone to getting him back in line to challenge for the World Heavyweight Championship. The same desires that Roman Reigns houses. Well, I'll tell you, tonight these two men go one-on-one. -on -one. Only one man is going to get their hand raised here at Backlash. And later tonight, when Guther and Braun Breaker collide, who will hold the gold? But for the first time since 2022, the head of the table, the Tribal Chief, not only walks down the aisle, but when the bell sounds, will compete between the ropes with that man, the Scottish warrior, Drew McIntyre. It is the official return of Roman Reigns. And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds. We talked about how Drew McIntyre felt disrespected after he fell short against Guthrie at WrestleMania. Felt disrespected that Roman Reigns returned in that moment. In McIntyre's words, walked over his cold, dead body just to institute the fact that he was coming for the world title. Well, tonight McIntyre has a chance at redemption. But for Roman Reigns, tonight is chapter one and a comeback story. A man who has been there and done that has won world championships many a times in the WWE, dating all the way back to 2015. But Roman Reigns walked away over two years ago to pursue greener pastures, having defeated everybody there was, had won every championship there was to win. Now Roman Reigns, similar to his cousins in the Usos, have returned to the WWE with a new purpose, and that's to do it all over again, and to challenge himself against the new competition that lies across Raw and SmackDown. Roman Reigns wants to get in the ring with the World Heavyweight Champion and wants to get in the ring with the Ring General Gunther regardless of whether he leaves tonight with the gold. Tonight, Roman Reigns has a chance to prove himself as the next number one contender. Certainly a task easier said than done when you were in there with a man who, as we mentioned, once held the World Heavyweight Championship for 267 days. And here we go, we are hot out of the gate. Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns kicking things off here at Backlash. Roman Reigns running full head of steam, I am sure is not in a good mood coming out of SmackDown last night in the Kia Center in Orlando, Florida. McIntyre's been salivating for this moment since Saturday night, March the 2nd, when he lost at WrestleMania and Roman Reigns made his return. A month and change later, McIntyre and Roman finally meet between the bells. Roman trying to come hot out of the gate. Drew McIntyre with different plans. McIntyre has had one goal since losing the World Heavyweight Championship to Gunther back on November the 19th of last year at Survivor Series. And it is very simple. Win back the World Heavyweight title. Easier said than done. The competition at an all-time high on Friday Night SmackDown, especially with the re-emergence of the head of the table, Roman Reigns. McIntyre won back-to-back -back Elimination Chamber matches in January, went on to main event his second straight WrestleMania. Unfortunately, Gunther was just the better man in a war of all wars in AT&T Stadium. McIntyre has certainly had a different vibe about him over the last five and so weeks. 
A lot of that has to do with the man he meets tonight, Roman Reigns. And Roman looking to cut the jugular off of Drew McIntyre, sending him over the top rope to get back into this matchup. An amazing display of power and a vicious assault at that as Roman Reigns tries to bounce back in your opening moments of the opening contest. I want to thank you for joining us. We are live tonight from the Coliseum in San Juan, Puerto Rico, the highly anticipated backlash event. Kicking things off the biggest way we possibly could. Roman Reigns, Drew McIntyre, mano y mano. And so much action on hand tonight. Championships to be decided. An ambulance match between Cody Rhodes and Randy Orton. A must-see event as Roman Reigns hits a must-see fall-away neckbreaker on Drew McIntyre. McIntyre had the fire within him in the early moments of this matchup. Roman Reigns taking the fight to the outside, breaking things down into a brawl, and has taken the lead in this contest. And going for the Roman's first cover of the matchup. I think Roman knows it's going to take a lot more to keep down the man who just kept up with ease, and that's Drew McIntyre. Might have been trying to get into the psyche with that pinfall attempt, but nonetheless, McIntyre flipping the switch and looking to stomp the championship desires right out of the soul of the Tribal Chief. As we mentioned, Roman Reigns, former WWE Champion, former Universal Champion before it was merged with the WWE title, right around the time Roman Reigns walked away from WWE two years ago. Off the belly to belly, now McIntyre into the cover again. Only a two, only a one, excuse me. Roman Reigns has fought the best, he has beaten the best, but Drew McIntyre, a man he has stepped in the ring with before, may be better than ever. Drew McIntyre, the 2023 Superstar of the Year for good reason. Defended that World Heavyweight Championship with honor against any and all challengers, premium live events, editions of SmackDown, you name it, McIntyre was ready to step up. Ever since he's lost that title back at Survivor Series last year, he has not been the same man and has certainly not been the same man since WrestleMania. Roman Reigns does not give a damn about the vibe, about the attitude of the Scottish Warrior. Roman's here to conquer the Scottish Warrior here tonight. Certainly a test of wills between these two egos. Two combustible elements that have been exploding week after week on Friday Night SmackDown. The Claymore kick by McIntyre was the line in the sand. It was all Roman needed. All bets were off after that first night of action when SmackDown returned to Philadelphia five weeks ago. Now Roman Reigns ready to duke it out with the best of them. Drew McIntyre first on the list. Will it be a successful return in between the ropes? Or will Drew McIntyre get his championship aspirations back on track tonight? Live rounds being thrown as these two juggernauts shot for position here in the Coliseum. McIntyre going to score the best of them. Roman Reigns has looked good in this matchup so far, but you got to believe McIntyre just one step ahead. And one thing we have failed to mention so far is has there been any ring rust on Roman Reigns? Obviously, he's been in the ring training week after week, preparing for this return. It's a whole other ball game where the bell sounds, and you're in there with that beast that is known as Drew McIntyre. Cover once more, and again a one count. Drew McIntyre might have fall short to Gunther back at WrestleMania as well as Survivor Series, but the names that McIntyre beat during his World Championship run, a who's who of superstars, from Hall of Famers like Edge to future Hall of Famers like John Cena and Randy Orton. You got names like AJ Styles, Austin Theory in there. The list goes on. Roman Reigns, championship or not, may be next on the Scottish Warriors list. And look at the strength being shown. My goodness, McIntyre taking Roman Reigns for a ride. An amazing superplex. San Juan, Puerto Rico in agreement. And as Drew comes off the top, an elbow to the heart. You got to believe that's going to do it. Not to be denied is Roman Reigns. McIntyre 
Stacking the offense there. Superplex and then an uncharacteristic elbow from the top. Drew McIntyre realizes he's got to dig down deep to try to take out Roman Reigns tonight. Maybe the 10 beats. A borrowed man maneuver from his good friend Sheamus will do the trick. And Roman Reigns going for another ride. Drew McIntyre may not have gotten the victory just yet, but is having his way. Look at the Warrior go flying. Over the top rope, Roman Reigns has got to have no idea what just hit him. McIntyre bringing the fight back inside the squared circle where he can get the job done. The one, two, three that he oh so desires. Into the pinfall he goes. And another close call. Roman Reigns surviving, certainly wouldn't say thriving at the current moment. Oh, wait a minute. McIntyre looked to be gearing up for Glasgow Kiss, but Roman caught him in the sleeper hold. An amazing counter. Roman Reigns springing into action, but will it be enough to pass out, to take down Drew McIntyre? McIntyre trying to figure out a way to hold on. Roman's got that submission in tight. McIntyre creating some distance and a big neck breaker as both men go down momentarily. You gotta believe McIntyre is willing to risk it all tonight. In means of success, Glasgow Kiss. Desperate for victory, and he may have just earned it. Into the cover. And yet another close call, but Roman Reigns is still alive. McIntyre dictating the majority of this matchup so far. Roman Reigns trying to find a window of opportunity. He may have done just that, a spear. Will that do it? And McIntyre gets the shoulder up. You gotta believe Roman Reigns has not done enough damage to the Scottish Warrior. The Coliseum ready to blow the roof off this place. Roman Reigns with an emphatic spear. You gotta believe, as I mentioned, not enough damage done to Drew McIntyre just yet as he reverses Roman Reigns into the spine buster. Roman Reigns is showing signs of life when he needs to, just enough to hang in there. But I would say the majority of this matchup has been dictated by the actions of the Scottish warrior Drew McIntyre. McIntyre would not have it any other way as he goes into the corner. History about to repeat itself. Claymore! McIntyre, desperate for victory. But Roman Reigns will not be denied in his return bout tonight. At least not yet. Shoulder off the canvas. McIntyre in disbelief. The Claymore kick that knocked out Roman Reigns five weeks ago in Philadelphia. Not enough to keep him down here in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Drew McIntyre meeting Roman Reigns on the outside of the ring. What could be going through the mind of the Scottish warrior as he looks to find another way to keep down the tribal chief? What is going on in the mind? If anything right now, if Roman Reigns even has his wherewithal after that Claymore kick, Roman's got to figure out a way to get back into this matchup. This very well could be the matchup McIntyre needed to get his confidence back to refocus on the World Heavyweight Championship that he's oh so desperate to obtain. Roman Reigns struggling to get to his feet on the outside and McIntyre just running him over with a shoulder block. Not to sound like a broken record, but Roman Reigns certainly may be surviving, but is absolutely not thriving at the current moment. Sent back into the ring, not by will, but by force of his opponent. There's a counter there. Misstep by McIntyre, and Roman Reigns, with that explosive nature about him, finds a second gear. McIntyre goes down. Roman Reigns goes up. Tilt to a big time slam. The strength from Roman Reigns to muscle up Drew. Not enough to get the three count. McIntyre might have survived that spear a few moments ago, but does not mean damage wasn't done. See Roman Reigns after the scoop and a slam, couple of kicks to the rib cage. Roman may be looking to focus on the midsection of Drew McIntyre. 
Right now, Roman's just got to keep on the offense. Let it stack up. Stay in the driver's seat. McIntyre again, not allowing Roman Reigns to get going. There's another counter by Roman. And who's going to get the momentum here? And Roman Reigns says, I want it with emphatic force. And now look at the strength again. Roman Reigns certainly being a powerhouse tonight at Backlash. Sit out powerbomb, but McIntyre gets the shoulder off the canvas. And later tonight, we are going to see Gunther defend the World Heavyweight Championship against Braun Breaker. You got to believe the winner of that matchup may be awaiting the winner of this matchup for the World Heavyweight title. Backlash certainly going to have major implications on the main event of Friday Night SmackDown. Roman Reigns again with a suplex. You see Roman stacking his own offense. The power game has got him back into this match. But Roman dishing it right back to Drew. Drew hit the elbow earlier. Roman giving a taste of his own medicine. McIntyre might have controlled a lot of this matchup, but Roman Reigns has kicked it into a new gear. Wait a minute. Back in the corner. Roman Reigns with a spear. The second of the matchup. Drew McIntyre cut in half. Roman Reigns with a massive victory upon his WWE in-ring return. Drew McIntyre is going to have to go back to the drawing board and try to refocus another way. You hate to see it for a man who was the flag bearer of SmackDown for well over a year. But Roman Reigns came back tonight with a vendetta. He came to settle the score with Drew McIntyre. And you got to believe now that the head of the table will set his sights on the World Heavyweight Championship that is defended later tonight between Gunther and Braun Breaker. One hell of a contest to kick things off at Backlash and one hell of a victory for your Tribal Chief. Coming your way on Saturday night, September 14th, witness the aftermath of the biggest party of the summer, SummerSlam, as WWE and Noah Nation Gaming channel memberships proudly present No Mercy. No Mercy comes to you live from the Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Don't miss championship clashes, personal battles, high stakes, and high rewards all on the line on the 14th of September at WWE No Mercy.